What's up guys? Welcome to a review of the Roaring Fire Gear Armadillo Mini Tool Roll. I was sent this for review by Roaring Fire Gear. They're very awesome people and I hope to do more reviews for them in the future. I'm also testing out a new mic setup as you can hear the AT2020 will be uh, overlaid audio instead of the direct iPhone camera audio and I will also be testing out the wide angle camera on the iPhone 12 here when I actually open this thing. Uh, I do apologize for any shaking by the way with the camera setup. I hope it's not too bad. I can't seem to fix it right now, but um, hopefully I can. Anyway, this is the tool roll. It is the smaller edition. They're, they have a larger one called the pack mule roll, which is huge. Like I, I don't have enough stuff to even put in there, but um, this is a water resistant canvas material. And it also has these two little loop fields right here. So if you want to put patches or something, you can. Uh, a nice grab handle. Very, uh, very good stitching here. Very comfortable grab handle. These two loops, I, I put a carabiner in here, but it comes with this uh, strap. So you can wear it around your sh over your shoulder if you really want to. And um, these adjustable buckles that's that on the outside so this is the black color it has they have three other colors as well but this is my favorite out of the out of all of them so basically how this tool roll works is you just open it and uh, it, it's like a three-fold kind of thing so let's see the other camera I zoomed out now we can see everything so it rolls open like this, and then you have the cover. And you have, so you have 12 elastic bands and 12 pockets. These are varying sizes. Um, this last band right here is pretty, uh, pretty small. And this band right here is actually, it was stitched over. If you can see, this box stitching actually goes over the top, so you can't slip anything through it, but it can be used as a retention kind of thing if you have a longer object there. So you have those, and you also have this uh, YKK zippered pocket right here, which is, is pretty cool. Um, this is actually a redone edition of their tool roll. They had one before that uh, was just like, it was um, kind of hard to explain, but it didn't have this cover on it. It would just, it would open up and they had, it's a kind of like a mirrored thing. They had loops here and here. So, so, but when you close it, all the tools would be hitting themselves instead of when you have here, nothing will be scratching or anything because of this cover. So I really like this edition. I much prefer this version. Um, and, uh, at, at, at 40 bucks, I think this is for 40 bucks. Like I think it's pretty good. Um, I would, I would say that's like probably the mo the most I'd pay for it, but um, when I was looking at co uh, comparable options on like Amazon, for instance, I saw something. I saw a Carhartt tool rule, and um, what I noticed is that a, a lot of them didn't have this cover here. This kind of has a compromise of both because some of them had just zippered pouches, some of them had just loops and no cover. Um, and I think having a combination of the both is the best way to go. So this Roaring Fire did a really good job on that with this product. Um, so I haven't loaded this out in any particular. I just put a bunch of random stuff in here to, to show the capacity of, the, of it. So like here I got this is Sofern headlamp, but this is a pretty big pocket. You can fit. It's the biggest pocket of them. These are all like Leatherman tools. Uh, four, four and a quarter inch frame Leatherman. Um, and as you get over here, you can fit thinner items like pencil, sharpies, pen lights. Same with this, uh, elastic. I'm not sure how long this elastic will hold up. Like if it'll keep its shape. I've had this stuff in here for a few days now. And it seems to be holding up pretty well. Um, but I think my favorite part is having this pocket. You can throw it anything you want. Like, I mean, I have a whole sharpener in here field notes you know it's three and a half five and a half notebook and um, when you roll it up you can 
and depending on the size you can is there adjustable buckles right so you can just you know if it's too too loose you can just cinch it down or loosen it up so I think it gives you a lot of flexibility um, so this would be good for you know putting in a bag or something if you want to carry a bunch of tools however um, I was comparing it to like the vault case for instance but uh and this does i think it has more capacity but also obviously it's not as protected as something like that it doesn't it's not like completely uh zip close you know in terms of being watertight or um like stopping from like debris getting in but i think it's a lot more flexible and it's a lot more uh it's a lot lighter depending on what you put in it but over like inherently it's lighter because it's made out of canvas instead of like being a hard shell case um and it's a little cheaper so I would say this is probably my favorite product from Roaring Fire Gear um, but a lot of their stuff is like you know pretty good especially for the price and they they do nice uh, high-vis lining which reminds me of Vanquist which I really like uh, and here I mean I don't I think this color looks really I don't think they could they don't really need to have high-vis lining for someone like this may be like in the bottom of this pocket if you had a bunch of small things but I think this is really good just the way it is so um yeah that's all I really have to say about it I think tool rolls are not a obviously it's not something they invented they've been around for a long time but I think the way they've kind of made the best of both worlds and having elastic pockets a protective layer and a zipper pocket is really what uh, sets it apart from other things on the market plus other things are made by companies that are just tool brands versus being ones that you know have more edc consumers in mind so yeah so thank you to roaring fire gear for setting this i will be including a link below and a discount code if you use code edc obsession you get 10 percent off on your order so if you want to do that that would help me a lot uh, these will also be affiliate links so they will inherently help me if you use them so yeah, thank you for watching guys. I hope you enjoy.